Hi everybody, it's Stacy from Peony Lane Designs. Hey, I'm gonna go jumping today, but if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, click the link below. So I have some running around to do today. Actually, I have another doctor's appointment. That's a really long story and I don't want to talk about it. I'm so sick of it. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna be over in the East Metro in a more affluent neighborhood and there's a savers over there and i just got a coupon yeah let's get out of the driveway it snowed last night i know i live in minnesota and it snows quite a bit but i'm not a fan i'll be honest with you um yeah i got a coupon from savers for 50 percent off up to ten dollars and it expires in two days so even though it's senior tuesday this doctor is only in on Tuesdays. So, unfortunately, every time I go to this doctor and near this uh, nicer savers, it's always going to be Senior Tuesday. I'm going to go anyway. I'm going to take a chance that, uh, that it'll be okay. Maybe they'll stay home because of the snow. A lot of seniors do. Um, I went to a Senior Tuesday sale at one point and it was just it's first of all it's always packed always packed on senior tuesday and i get it hey i want to take advantage of the discounts too however i was in line and a particularly cranky senior and this isn't all seniors but she just you know it's that one bad apple moment she uh, was not happy that i was there and that i was not a senior so um, I had one item, a chair, she had a cart full of stuff and she felt that I should not be in line in front of her because I'm not a senior and what was I doing there anyway? I don't know why I attract these people, but it seems to happen quite frequently for me that, uh, crazy people like me. Uh, you're not crazy, are you? Alright, so... I'm gonna brave it. I'm gonna go on Senior Tuesday. I gotta get through this doctor's appointment first. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna get out there and see what they've got. I have a couple big sales coming up. I want to load my Etsy shop because there's something special coming up that I will share with you, but not right now. But um, it's kind of important for me to get my shop in order and back up to speed. I have sold quite a bit lately. I'm trying to post at least three items a week, as you know from the goals video. If you haven't seen the goals video, I'll put the link in the cards. Um, but I would like to actually increase that. Yeah, I wanna do a little experiment. So right now it is the end of January, and now I've been reading articles that say if you post every day on Etsy, it improves your search ability and your function. You know, people will find you more. So, I wanted to test that. I wanted to do like an entire month of posting one post at least a day. So yeah, we're gonna try it. And it's gonna start this week. I'm gonna start, I'll do a video for you guys so you can see exactly what happens, all the stats. So if you're interested in selling on Etsy, let's find out if that theory is true. Because, you know, there's no, like Etsy hasn't said that. It's just been little blog post here and a Reddit article that I saw and I want to see if it's true. I want to test it. So I'm going to post every day and I'll show you guys what happens. But let's get to this doctor's appointment, get it over with, and then go see if we can find a saver. Let's go junk it. Done with my doctor's appointment. Get tired of this doctor's appointment. It's still snowing. Oh well. Let's go over to Senior Savers. Oh 
Oh, I can't forget my lucky junkin hat. Ooh, ooh, got it. My winter one got coffee spilled on it, so we're gonna have to bake two. Don't squash. We're almost there. Okay, so the coupon is 50% off, up to $10. So $5 maximum off. So I gotta at least spend $10, don't you think? I think so, let's go. As anticipated it was crowded lots of seniors and it's every Tuesday it's 40% off for seniors so um, I tend to try and avoid Tuesdays but uh, when you've got a coupon that's expiring and you're gonna be in the area and I don't get to this area enough um, to be able to use that coupon I did find some treasures although they were crawling all over me, people. <laughs> Not to be rude, but holy cow! Yeah, there were um, elderly people crawling up my butt. They were just like pushing me, pushing me, pushing me through the aisles. There was a couple people in particular, and it was like they were right there on my backside pushing me. I was not thrilled with that, but I did find some treasures. Look what I found. bunch of garden stuff. I'm thinking spring on a snowy, icky, cruddy day. I want to think spring and flowers and terrariums and yeah, I've got a, a booth this spring that'll look gorgeous because of those pieces, but um, I did spend a little more than I wanted to. The girl that did the checkout did not know what she was doing and forgive me, I, I know I'm wholly critical, but she told me that I had to ring up my coupons separate from all the other purchases and oh no you can't ring up all your purchases and then scan the coupon and I'm like why <laughs> that didn't make any sense to me because uh it's coupon it only it says maximum five dollars it'll only take five dollars off she's like nope no nope. well you have to run it through twice I don't want to run it I just want one transaction so then people behind me were annoyed because she I basically had to do two separate checkouts and she was slow as molasses, which you come to expect for certain thrift stores that they're just really slow. And then she suggested I get a box and pack my stuff. It was like, all right. So I packed up my own stuff. Customer service is not uh, job one at Savers, that's for sure. But yeah, it was busy crazy busy and a lot of elderly people which I think it's just the day out I really don't think they need anything <laughs> and they're taking their own sweet Lucy time just looking at every little bit of you know anything so yeah but I did find some treasures and that's always great I'll have some good garden stuff for the booth this this year and that little lamb oh it's not the sweetest little lamb definitely a vintage ceramic lamb so cute that might pop up on the Etsy store. You'll have to take a look and see if it shows up there. Um, I'll make a decision soon. Happy Junket, everyone. Thanks for watching. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, click the subscribe link below. Um, as usual, I'm grateful for your time. Thanks, everyone.
happy junket. Bye. Visit my blog, peonylanedesigns.com, for more tips, tricks, and inspiration. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon so you'll be notified of new videos. I post every week DIY tutorials and, of course, more Junkin videos.